I gotta take a minute. You might need to just relax for a minute before you get into doing all I that. wanted to record it though. Pass me a fork. Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. I'm gonna show y'all how I do my um, slick back bun with a middle part. So all you'll need is a hard bristle brush, a soft bristle brush, and um, a loose, a paddle brush or this brush. It'll work fine. And an edge brush, obviously. And, hold on. Three rubber bands, this is two, but you need three. Leave-in conditioner and a gel of your choice. That's all you need. Well, that's all I use. I always start with wet hair because I don't like using um, that hard bristle brush on my dry hair. So I always start with damp hair and just loosening up the curls and brush brushing it in the direction I want my bun. So it makes it easier when you're using your hard bristle brush because you don't want to be brushing like against um, the direction, if that makes sense, because it's really going to break your hair. The leave-in conditioner I'm using is the Mayel Hawaiian Ginger Moisturi Moisturizing Leave-in Conditioner. I like, I just really want to put moisture in my hair because um, I feel like that reduces the breakage. Make sure you focus on your ends. By the way, my lashes look like this because I just washed them. I didn't wash them, but I like rinsed them with water because my they looked really oily. Just massage that in. And I'm gonna put some on top too, since that's where we're gonna be brushing it. All right, now we're gonna add our gel. I don't like to add too much. I used to wear this hairstyle like every single day in high school. Because who the hell feels like doing a whole curly hair routine before school? And my dad was a teacher, so I had to wake up even earlier. Like I had to wake up and we live like um, 30 minutes away from the school. And I used to, um, freshman year, I used to wake up at like 5 a.m. to do, to beat my face. Dark times. Now that our gel is in our hair, we're gonna brush it in. And notice how I'm like uh, following it with my hand to make sure it's slick. Oh, that hurt. All right, I'm gonna hold it in a ponytail and I'm going to take my hard bristle brush. Let me go ahead and take that out. And just brush it. Let me make sure this part is slick. Make sure you have your two rubber bands on your wrist so you're ready. And I take my soft brush and just make sure that the front part right here is slick because mine likes to separate. Just polish it up around the head. Now we're gonna take our third hair tie and make the bun. Why does this side always look so bad? And now we're gonna take our edge brush. Mine has gel on it. 
And I'm gonna try to do fluffy edges today. I don't think I have enough hair out, but I don't want them to be like super slick. And I think my hair, my edges are too long for that. Yeah, no, that's not gonna work. It ain't gonna work. <sighs> this is really pushing my buttons right now. Now the little ear piece. I used to do these so dramatic. I would do like a whole little um, swirl. I think I have a picture. I would definitely add it. It was so ugly. I don't know why I thought I was doing something. And now looking back, I'm like, I think people were complimenting me because they thought it looked bad. This is the side with my good edges. This is my good edge side. See, they always cooperate. They love me. I spoke too soon. I give up. I'm not gonna, this is as good as it's gonna get. I'm so mad that these edges look so good and these don't. Mm, 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 mm. Now we're ready for the day. Purr. Me in the in the camera. I, I want you to see my face. Uh, yeah. All right, this is my Target haul. So I got this cute black bag. I have a lot of cute pur black purses. I wanted every purse they had. I'm cooking right now. That's why everything is out. It was only $20. Can you stop staring at me? But I like this because I like envelope bags and I needed like a simple Whoa. bag for um, like dinner and stuff. And for bees, they didn't have the regular ones I used. So we got this Hawaiian one. I'll put a review on that. And these bleach and blue bowl sanitary stuff, like you put it like on top of the um thing, where you, like the top of the toilet, where you take the top off. I don't know what these are for, but I got them. And Comet, because we're gonna clean the bathroom tomorrow. He got this, a loofah. Microfiber towels. Because I'm tired of using um, paper towels. And this. Because we we've been drinking non-filtered water for like... For like four months. Yeah. Yeah, we have.
I'm currently really sleepy, but I can't go to sleep. And this happens literally every night. Like it's, I end up, I usually end up going to sleep at like 1 a.m. or some sometime around there. Cause I told y'all, did I tell y'all I've been waking up at 10 a.m. Which is way too late. Cause I get really irritated when I don't have like my whole day ahead of me. Ideally, I would like to wake up at 7 a.m. But no, I go to sleep at the crack of dawn. It's because like before I go to sleep, I, it feels like I'm on Adderall every single time. Like right now, I'm thinking of a rebrand. I'm pulling out my journal. I'm listing ideas. I want a new wardrobe. I I want to um I want to start working out. I want to do my makeup differently. I want I want new makeup. I want to start promoting clothes instead of on on TikTok. I don't want to promote makeup anymore. I don't want to do skincare anymore. It's exhausting. It is exhausting. And then I wake up the next morning and don't do shit the whole day. Do any of y'all have this problem? Like, why can I have this motivation while I'm out? Like, I need to I need to take my ass to sleep. This is why I don't do, get shit done. Because I stay up all night planning for the future. And I'm too tired of the... I'm too tired the next day to do anything. Good morning. As you can see, the bed isn't even made, but... I got a text that there's a package, so I'm gonna get that. Cause that's my priority. Um, no, yeah, I know I look crazy. Let's see, Benji. Oh my goodness. Good morning. Good morning. That's why you sleep in the crate. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, he wants some food. He wants some food, Benji. Come on. You hungry? I'll feed them before I get my package. Are you hungry? I'm gonna wash his bowls. All right, and now we can go get my package. I look like Adam Sandler. So this is, I have a couple packages coming today. This is the first one. I need a box opener. That's what I need to get from Amazon. That big ass box for this. These are um, like Bluetooth remotes for my phone so I could take pictures on my tripod. They came with two with a little thing because they're really easy to lose. So I'm glad they came with this little strap. But yeah, you need these if you like taking your own pictures. How do I put these on? How is it supposed to? Oh, like that. Just a little loop. I would like to get to know if I could be the kind of girl that you could be down for.
Cause when I look at you, I feel something tell me That you're the kind of guy that I should make a move on I'm just so you know, and I won't be for you I could be wrong, but I feel like something could be going on The more I see you, the more that it becomes so true There ain't no love for me, it's only you I wanna be done with what you're going Outside. You ready? You think he's ready, guys? You ready to go get some exercise? <laughs> this is my dog walking outfit. Um, Lululemon, Lululemon leggings and an Urban Outfitter top. I literally just got out the shower, but I don't want to wait till my boyfriend comes home to take him out. Cause I don't like taking him out late. Um, well, later during the day. So I'm gonna just do that now. I literally have like leave-in conditioner and oil in my hair and stuff. But anything for the pooch. I get a banana. Hug, Benji. Uh-oh. See, I know my dog so well. Just got done straightening the hair and I hate these flyaways, oh my gosh. But now I'm about to eat my leftovers from yesterday. I had Rock South. It, it wasn't really like, it wasn't the best. It's usually really good, but I think it was missing some seasoning. I never finish my food. How am I gonna put this on here? It just doesn't hit the same the next day. That's only when it comes to pasta. But anything else, I always taste better the next day. I'm not gonna eat all this. gonna try not to smack so last night I watched Carisha please for the first time and I really liked it I watched it because I saw Lotto posted it and I really like her she's just beautiful and she seems like really genuine and she's like really talented so I'm like let me watch this and it was really funny it was super funny Carisha is hilarious Not even hot. I warmed it up for two minutes. It needs more potatoes. I mean, tomatoes. 
But yeah, it was really funny. I'm gonna watch, I gotta watch the Kevin Gates one. Cause I'm like, if this was funny, the Kevin Gates is gonna be funny. packages came try not to show the address so I got my favorite lash shampoo this lasts for like two years I swear and I'll try not to show the address this fan Hopefully I don't have to put batteries in it because last time I got a different one. But it like broke down on me. Oh, it has a charger. Oh, 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 oh it has a little stand. That's cute. Oops. I honestly don't even know what this one is. You just gonna watch me? Okay. Mm. It's a shower head. I'm excited. The wrong shower head. What's up with this Lord of the Rings stuff? the wrong one no you talking about ain't nothing so much about that one so i sent you a second one this is a pillow So that's how the pillow looks. I'm definitely gonna need two decorative pillows right here because it looks out of place. But, and it's kind of throwing me off how this is beige and the sheets are bright white. So I'm probably gonna get some new sheets. And yeah. So this is what the shower head looks like. I installed it all by myself with my pink tool kit. Real handyman, I know. And the shower caddy did not fit on top of it. Like it was blocking the bottom part because this is like a really big square so we're gonna have to get a shower like shower shelves that stick on the wall which make me really nervous because i'm like how is it gonna stay there with all these products so we put the products right here like the shower stuff for now and i don't know i'm gonna have to like read a lot of reviews on some shower shelves because the so I tried to film an unboxing yesterday, but it did not go so well. I got this. Can you turn the AC on? I'm sweating. Bro, I mean. I gotta take a minute. You might. Because 
everything just wasn't going smoothly. So I'm gonna, I already unboxed it obviously, but I'm gonna like try everything on. I just came back from eating sushi with my friend Kayla and um, I'm literally so sleepy. It's not even 10 o'clock and I'm really sleepy. The perfume duo I did or perfume concoction is the Valentino Born in Roma. Classic, everybody likes this. You really, you really can't go wrong. It's just warm vanilla and the Dossier Ambery Vanilla. They're they're too similar. This is this is um inspired by black op I just spit. But this is inspired by inspired by black opium. So if you have that, just combine the two. And they will smell like a warm vanilla balm. Mm-hmm. Cause this is this is kind of strong. It lasts all day, but like I kinda get tired of, of this smell. Everyone has it. No, but for real. When I was in middle school, um I I was in sixth grade, still, you know, still elementary school mindset. I recorded, I got like first introduced to social media when I was in fifth, in fifth grade. I was 12 years old. Big mistake because I'm like, you know what? I can sing. So I posted a video of me singing for real. My best friend at the time hyped me up. She was like, yeah, you got to post this shit. Yeah. My little eighth grade crush was crying with laughter when he like, cause we, I used to go to like before school and after school and I saw him at the before school and he was literally dying. Like tears coming out his face when he was like talking about my singing video. I'm like, never again, never again will I be that vulnerable. Thank you. 